Hello, my name is Rich Howard, owner of Architectural Builder Supply, and this video is to bring you a closer look at the Hager number 273W curved roller stop. Shown to you in the 26D satin chrome finish. Available in different architectural finishes. Solid brass construction with that satin chrome finish on it. Screws are included. Uh, the plastic anchors are unexpected, but nonetheless they're included. Three flathead number eight by one inch or so uh, sheet metal screws. Curved roller stops are a specialized piece of hardware that you don't see very often, but when you do see it, it's because they're solving a very particular problem. Where you see a curved roller stop like this is going to be when you have two walls are, that are on an inside corner, and on wall A, let's say, you'll have a left-hand door, and then on wall B, you'll have the same left-hand door as well. So you've got a wall here and a wall here. This wall will have a left-hand door swinging in, as will this door have a left-hand door swinging in. So you've got a door that swings over this way, but then the other one comes into its space. Okay, So the curved roller stop is appropriate for solving that problem. So if you have a left-hand door, my arm here is a left-hand door, and then another left-hand door opens into its space, and then it's, you know, pushed closed or whatever the case might be, it'll make contact with that door and push it away. Is how that is how that is intended to work. Or vice versa, if the one door is out in the open and the second door opens too much, it comes and it pushes it out and away through its space. And that's where you're going to see it. Or also I've seen this uh, in a retail space, um, a fast food restaurant, that sort of place, uh, a, 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 an outswinging restroom door that will be a left hand, well technically a right hand reverse. And then you'll have a closet on the op on the perpendicular wall that's also a right hand reverse. That could be a custodial or access to the back of the kitchen area, let's say. Um, that would be a perfect example of where you would end up using a curved roller stop like that. Okay, uh, Dimensionally, the projection is what Hager is giving, and that is a very important dimension. At 2 and 21 30 seconds, so basically 2 and 5 eighths. Get that all lined up there. I'm going to say no on that. Be closer to 2 and 2 and 13 sixteenths would be would be what I would say that would be. Okay. And overall length, at least it wasn't glass. Overall length, it's going to be just about five inch, which is pretty typical for these. This looks about five and a quarter. And overall height of the base, about two and an eighth. And then overall width of the base, about inch and five eighths. Pardon me, inch and three quarter. It's certainly a very nice quality item, very nice fit and finish on this Hager product, who is a full line provider of all things, or many things, trim and auxiliary related. Not only something somewhat unusual like a curved uh, roller stop, but the common door stops, push and pull hardware, kick plates, a variety of other items, uh, crash chains and you know recessed flush poles, etc. They also have a comprehensive offering of weather stripping. Uh, door closers, lock sets, uh, sliding door hardware, exit devices, um, a full line of uh, aluminum continuous geared hinges under their Roton brand name, and then of course their namesake, Hager Hinge. Uh, they are a comprehensive provider of all things hinge related in both residential and commercial uh, needs. Any questions on the Hager 273W curved roller stop? or any other Hager product, please feel free to reach out to us. Thank you very much.